In Proposition 16, we prove that if any side of a triangle is extended, then the exterior angle is always greater than either of the opposite interior angles. To begin this proposition, we are given the triangle ABC, and we extend line BC with point D to create the exterior angle ACD. We will prove that angle ACD is greater than angle ABC and angle BAC. First, with line AC, we apply Proposition 10 to bisect it into two congruent lines. Therefore, line AE is congruent to line CE. Next, with postulate 1, we create line BE. And with postulate 2, we extend it to an arbitrary point F. With line BF and line BE, we apply Proposition 3, so that line BE is congruent to line EF. Next, we create line CF, and we extend line AC with point G. Now, looking at the intersecting straight lines BF and AC, we can see that by Proposition 15, the vertical angles AEB and CEF are congruent. Since triangle AEB and triangle CEF both share a corresponding side, angle, and side, then by proposition 4, triangle AEB is congruent to triangle CEF, line AB is congruent to line CF, and angle BAE is congruent to angle FCE. So looking at angle DCE, we can see that by axiom 5, it is greater than angle FCE. Now since angle BAE is congruent to angle FCE, then by axiom 5, angle DCE is also greater than angle BAE. Next, looking at the intersecting straight lines BD and EG, we can see that by proposition 15, the vertical angles DCE and BCG are congruent. With line BC, we apply Proposition 10 to bisect it into two congruent lines. Therefore, line BH is congruent to line CH. With postulate 1, we create line AH, and we extend line AH to an arbitrary point I. With lines AI and AH, we apply Proposition 3. Therefore, line AH is congruent to line IH. Next, we create line IC with postulate 1. So looking at the intersecting straight lines BC and AI, we can see that by Proposition 15, the vertical angles BHA and CHI are congruent. Since triangle ABH and triangle ICH both share a corresponding side, angle, and side, then by Proposition 4, triangle ABH is congruent to triangle ICH. Line AB is congruent to line IC, and angle ABH is congruent to angle ICH. Next, looking at angle BCG, by axiom 5, it is greater than angle ICH. Now since angle ABH is congruent to angle ICH, then by axiom 5, angle BCG is also greater than angle ABH. Since angle DCE is congruent to angle BCG, then by axiom 5, angle DCE is greater than angle ABH. And therefore, we have proven that the exterior angle DCE is greater than either of the opposite interior angles.